Welcome back to more Auto Nuts. Last time we began our fields of wheat, and now we have it. They've almost made the entire field a lovely rippling yellow sea of delicious wheat. It's all fine. Um, yeah, so we only just started that last time, but I've let things run on quite a bit, and partially so I can get a thumbnail for the previous episode, but shush. But also to do quite a bit of fixing around the place um, based on various things, such as um, the stick situation I have now solved, um, because it occurred to me that I can get sticks just by hammering trees as well as cutting them down. And so now we've got a lad here who just literally goes around hitting things with hammers and making sticks appear. Now that created a problem where it was creating too many acorns. So I've now got this lad over here feeding the acorns into the gob. Into the big stone end. Well, it's not stone end at all, it's more an Easter Island head, but that's getting rid of that. So we, had, we don't have a massive surplus of acorns, although we've still got this area, which is doing all the regular stuff. I've got rid of some of the older bots, because I don't like their, the cut of their jib anymore. They can just piss off and stay there. They are all the XXX bots now. They're just like, they're, they're obsolete and, they're, and they stink of oil and WD-40 and all kinds of things. So we've now got this little area set up. Um, this is not much change over here. Everything's pretty much ticking over. We're getting more and more wheat. I could probably make more out of this by, you know, threshing more or whatever. Uh, pumpkin lads, I just get busy getting on with it. I've also discovered um, that berries... Um, I've replaced the robots with better ones here. The berries can actually turn into herby berries, um, which is actually a level 2 food, which means that we can make a lot more out of just... At the moment, we're just bunging berries into the gobs of these lads. Um, we can get 10 times stuff out of that, so that's going to be a whole thing. The trouble is, this is all getting so cluttered, and I've been going on about this for a while. Um, I want to separate it all out, make the colony a bit more spread out, so things aren't just hemmed in. So I'm thinking about relocating the colony, the actual people colony, kind of maybe over here-ish? And I'm going to try and use billboards and something like that. We've got, I've, already, I've constructed a little billboard here, um, and I'm going to try and use that to like, redefine search areas and make that hopefully a bit easier. Um, also, I discovered, it, interestingly, it never occurred to me that you might be able to do this, but you can move paths around very easily. So really, what you could do is just like build a, you know, build a load of paths around the stone box and then just move them manually yourself. But to be honest, that seems like fiddly bollocks. It'll, it'll be quicker, but yeah, fiddly bollocks. So who cares? Yeah, so I might move that path somewhere. We've got plenty of path. I also, I've started thinking about dry stone walls. Maybe we can guide robots in, um, down the roads or whatever. But that will come later on once we actually move things. So yeah, so what I'll do is, well, hopefully we'll get some more food on the go. So I'll probably will end up making herby berries. Now we're making more. Oh god, that's that's out of juice. Now we're, going, we're making more of the berries, we will be able to hopefully do some cooking. I really feel like we could actually get some more... We could definitely make this a bit more efficient, because we, we've got berries on the ground, we've got berries in the bushes, not going into this berry box over here, which is not very full. Um, if, we wanna, if we wanna get cooking with these, we'll actually have to make it very full. We'll also be using the weeds to make the berry, the herby berries. Um, and we've got shitloads of those, because we've got such a big weed farm over here. Ha ha weed. Yes, yes, yes. I'm really pleased I didn't make a single actual drugs reference in that entire weedy farm episode, though, we did. But shush. Apart from the title. Double shush. Right, so what we'll do, first of all, we'll get ourselves... We need to get rid of this berry bush because it's pissing me off. I'm not quite sure which tool we'll need for that. Is it an axe? I think so. Let's have a go. I'm going to cut down anything that's going to get in our way. Oh. No. Can't get rid of it that way. Maybe a spade. Got, I've, I've been clearing up some of these spades. We had, we've got a million spades dotted around the colony, which I've now cleaned up. Have we got a spade? Yes, I have. Right, let's get rid of this. A second time, hopefully. These are just... Oh, I'm not using these at all, am I? We might, do it, we might start using it more now, if we're building more housing. Right, come on. Get, get rid. Get rid. So add. You know what I'm going to do? Here's what we'll do. We might need some more dry stone walls later on, but not now. So what I'm going to do is whip up... Let's, let's use the clone facility. Whip up a few walls like this. So we'll probably end up moving these. In fact, we'll definitely end up moving these because I'm going to move the path as well. And before we even know it, matey boy over here, constructor lad, has already started building them because he's still got the same area as he had for the road building. So that's all going to happen without us having to do anything else, which is nice. So now we've um, cleared a bit of area here. I might actually clear this out as well. 
Get rid, get rid, get rid. This is going to be where our lads live properly, not hemmed in over there. Oh god, there's more spades over here! I still haven't stored them all. All the spade boxes are totally full. Right, anyway, let's... Actually, what we'll do... Let's have a look to see what's actually here. Probably nothing, because it's the sandy beach. Yeah, a bit... Oh look! Rabbits! Oh no, they're more chucks. And there's a, ca there's a cow, a lovely, lovely cow. Alright. Also, let's just get rid of this hidden area. I'm going to see what's that... Oh, I can't actually go into the water. Oh, I'll never be able to get to Soil Island now. The best island of all. Right, so anyway, we've got a better place for our colony now. I might actually just pick up these berries. Um, and stick them into the berry box. All these jobs. Oh god, there's so many berries around. I might actually get a second store bot at some point, but let's not worry about that until we've decided what we're going to do exactly. What I'm going to do first of all is get my lad's sign, my lad's billboard. I think lads, basically billboards are the same as signs, only bigger. But this is where we're going to live. So let's put that kind of there-ish. Pick that up, put that down. Uh, actually, you pick, it, pick it up and then we can um, press Z. Um, we can set its area as basically here. So this is going to define our colony. And we don't have to set each individual bot to its own thing. I mean, we could do that its own area. We could do that with other things as well, like we've had to do repetitively over and over again. Oh my god, that field is so full. <laughs> anyway, yeah. So I guess we really just have to start relocating everyone. And then once we've done that, we can set all the all the bots that have an area over here, we can set that to the billboard rather than the area. And then pick up the billboard's area. So if we did, if we, did we could also build, um, move the billboard again somewhere else and if we wanted to move the colony again, but we probably won't. But we could. We won't. But we could. So now comes the this is, oh no ah oh no I've changed I'm changing the area that's that's not what I wanted at all come back put the area back and where was it I'm gonna pick it up put it there I think well, I want the sign to be facing us yes that'll do right so yes I've I've got to just basically move everything now this is going to take a while let's get going I'm gonna move so you. Well, let's make it so... There's going to be a cooking thing going on as well. But we don't really need to... I mean, we, the research station will probably end up moving over to the beach over here or something. But I really have to start thinking about the design of this place. What I might do, actually, is redefine the area a bit differently. I was going to, the sign's just going to get in the way, isn't it? So let's put it there. Pick it up again, actually. And, re, and redefine the area as just being down here. As long as we don't need the sign again, we should be grand. There we go. Oh! I... <laughs> there. Sorted. And now we continue to move the colony. Look at it. Pissing down. Oh, 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 oh. What's, what's the thing about it? Uh, oh, yeah, I've, I've started to arrange my colony. But what's the thing about it? And we've, we've um, uh, between episodes, um, the research for the cooking finished. So what I'm going to do is upgrade the cook one of the cooking pots for which we oh shit we need clay uh, we've got one clay there okay so he'll still be busy. yeah we'll we'll just do this we'll do a quick diversion because i want to get this up and running so we will need to i've just um, built loads more robot spots we've been chatting earlier so we do actually need to set up a new clay mining operation unfortunately that does actually also mean removing all this gunk which i've, I've, been, I've basically been using this as a, a pit a shit pit See also Astroneer early episodes <laughs> and for all my stuffs. So we'll have to move all this out of the way. I'm going to set up exactly the same thing as we did with the miners. So we'll need a pick. In fact, oh, hang on. Let's, um, let's swap out all my gunk because I seem to have got so much gunk on me at the moment. Like flails and things. So we'll need a pick. Store that. We'll get another pick. I assume you can do this fire. Oh, well, we better check, because we get caught out by this, by assumption and presumption and general brick a -rear. Let's see. Clay. Where are you, clay? Mortar? Coal? Charcoal? String? Skateboard? Soil? Sand. Seawater. Where the hell's clay, then? Clay. Clay, for some reason, is here. Oh, it's a spade. We need spade. 
spades. Right, okay. Get rid of these then. Let's get ourselves a little spady poos or two. Oh, I've still got my pick in my hand. Grab you, stow, grab you. And now let's go and teach one of these billion robots what to do. Oh, don't do that. Right. You, you're going to be a clay digger. And this is going to create an entire new set of robots. So, clay bots. Make them brown. And we have to do the same here as we did for the stone miners. I've, at some point I increased the number of stone miners, by the way. That's when I wanted to make sure that we got plenty of stones. So that's all going like the clappers now. Right, so we've got ourselves clay miners and also clay storers. So we still need to sort out this. Um, but we also need to get a torch. Now that's going to be a lot easier now because we do actually have straw for days over here. Now we've got our farm on the go, which is going to take a bit of time for him to scoot over here. One, two, three, four. And torch. I mean, it might some... Oh my god. Okay, this is bad. I think we may have a situation where both the winder lads who look after each other are both off at the same time, which does happen occasionally. Oh shit, we've got loads of sticks now. We finally got up to the stage where we've actually got a full stickery rather than a, an empty stickery. I don't know why I picked up so many sticks there, I don't actually need to do that. Right, torch, cooking pot. Oh, now we actually need those sticks. <laughs> Never mind, let's just grab some more. One, two, three, four. Do, 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 do. And clay. One, two, three. Yay! Yay! Woo! Yay! Oh, lads. Right at the bottom. Getting rather dull, that. So presumably that hasn't actually unlocked anything uh, in terms of the academy. We do need to get the... Oh, the arable thing's almost done, look. The only thing we haven't done is, ho is hoe the soil. Uh-oh. Did we... Did we miss out that? Ah. We may need to do some hoeing. I'll probably just do that, just to complete that thing at some point. But anyway, we need to sort out these lads, because something's gone hilariously wrong here. Have we just got, like, a dead zone of where no winder bots are, actually? Oh, we should have. It's just, I think... I think... Yeah, look, we've got two winder bots, two and three. In... Oh, the wind Over there. Oh, it's because I've got these pointlessly complicated ones. Oh, these early, these early winder bots I did it in a pointlessly complicated fashion, which I should really replace. Uh, which means I just need to quickly... Um, there are you. There you are. D do a bit of manual winding, I think. For now. There we go. Um, winder bot 3. Or winderoo. There we go. Right, that should sort out those lads. Yeah, there's still a few problems. Just occasionally the winder bots do do that. They get stuck. Right, so... Oh god, the walls are all complete now. In fact, what I might do then, in that case, is actually steal those walls. Um, in fact, here's what we'll do. We're trying to do a bit of guiding, so the bots kind of... don't... piss me off with their rampant diagonal behaviour. And presumably there'll be another line of colonists on the other side, and so on. And the path I'll probably move as well at some point. Oh, ooh, mm. Well, I, now we've moved things from here, we could. I, I might put the path along the beach. Because the beach is piss, and nobody cares about the beach. So now we need to start thinking about reprogramming our bot search areas. So we should just be able to go into the wolf shack. And... Colonist Berry Feed. This is the one I'm going to replace quite quickly, because we want to turn that into a, a weedy berry thing. So I'll wait for that. Let's do... Um, well, actually, let's just do them all in order. Find nearest crude hut. I have to extend this a bit. So this is now going to be over here. Oh, no, it's... Oh, hang on. No, 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 no. We're now using the billboard, aren't we? Oh, we'll have to do this. Oh, that's a pisser. Um, it's not the same sort of thing, so I'll actually have to do a bit of more reprogramming. Like that. Oh, move to billboard. That's not quite what I want.
Yeah, that was just me not really looking properly. Hang on, let's some um, select structure is what I gotta do. There we go. Then I can select the billboard. There. And that'll program it to presumably go with the billboard. So we should be fine there. And as I say, I just have to go along all these and change the area, so I'll do this off camera. Right, so I've reprogrammed all the areas, or some of them, most of them anyway. Um, I've actually got rid of the, the times one worth people and just abandoned that because I am going to change things around a little bit. I think I'm going to, I've made it so like um, Chef Kiss 1 is now Chef Herbie Pumpkin and we'll deal with this cooking pot over here. Things aren't logistically perfect at the moment, but at least we've got that up and running again. So he's busy making his Herbie Pumpkin and I was thinking, well... Since we haven't got, well, we actually have got loads of raw pumpkin at the moment, but we may also start doing the berries thing directly, turn it into Herbie Berries um, here in the, let's, let's rename Chef Kiss 2 to Chef Herbie Berries. So he is now going to do different things. I probably might need to just reset all this, because it is just going to be a mess otherwise. I've given him extra memory as well, because it's easier to program that way. So for this, we need him to go over to... Oh, the berries are over there. I think I might... Before we go on, I think it might be time to do a little bit of creative movements. I'll probably have more storage people to account for all this. Oh, I can do all three at once. Oh, previously, I've done it once at a time. It's a bit fiddly. I think this, this, this movement thing is still a little bit clammy because look it's still it's got a mouse separated from the actual cursor so i think there's a bug here in the current version but that sorted that out so the berry stores i will actually have to make another berry store as i say because look, look at all these look at all these dead berries oh god i think oh that's why i think possibly the um hang on this berry store has got a little bit i'm confused okay poor lad so let's oh well, it's because i've completely cancelled him <laughs> yeah Okay. Oh, shoot, it must be a different one then. Hmm, hang on. Oh, the, okay, okay. I think the XXX, there's actually an XXX underneath him. That's why. So I do need to change this berry store instead. He thinks there's still th something there. And so what I'll need to do is quickly just grab some berries. So I've got something in my hands. And program him to put that into there. So that needs to do that. That should work. Sometimes it gets confused. Um, yeah, that should that should sort that out. He's got a long way to go. As I say, I'll probably add more capacity to uh, to him. Um, sort that out. I don't really want. Oh yeah, he's. I've, I've named him something completely wrong now. I'm going to bung him out the way. Just so we don't get him in, in just uh, underfoot. Right, anyway. Now we need to go and teach the chef kiss lad. Properly. So I'm not going to try and copy the programming again like I did previously. Because that just ended up in absolute scenes, frankly. Right, so where are we? Oh, we haven't got crates for this. We've only got crates for the Herbie Pumpkin storage. Ooh, hang on. That'll have to be done. That will have to be done. Don't suppose there's any um, sneaky boxes I could th Oh, yes there are. Let's just do this. Yeah, that, for some reason that, that time only one of them came with me. Some awkward rotational thing. Yeah. There we go. And now we can finish teaching our thing. So you go... Have I got my hands full of anything? No, I need to pick up the spice berries and then put it in the thing. I think that's it. I think that's the entire program. Loop it. Still 4k free. Now, I mean, I didn't need to upgrade him, but when you're ed actually editing the lads, sometimes it is... You'll need that extra capacity. But Anyway, that should theoretically make uh, us have two kinds of food happening. So you've got the Herbie Pumpkin there. And we also need someone to feed the berries to the colonists. And we've got some spares up here. So I'll probably use one of those. 
Do 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 do. Hup. Where's the love shack, guys? Oh, the wolf shack. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's literally just open here. Right. So we need colonist bit feet. And what are you? Colonist bits feed. What are you? Oh, you you feed them. Oh, you feed them. Yeah. Are you the one who just literally just feeds it bits of pumpkin? Oh, we don't want you anymore. You're terrid. Okay, so I've renamed him Spiced Berry Feed. He is going to do the obvious thing. Go over here. Pick up those until your hands are full. And then you go distribute it to the colonists. You'll do. So do it by billboard. I will need to. Um, we'll, we'll actually need to do a bit of repeating. Hang on. So do. Until hands full, and then yes, that should do the trick. Until hands empty. Right there we go. Now we have bigger capacity. We replace the boring old feed and berries and feed and bits of pie. Finally, I say I say pie. I just mean bits of bits, uh, and we've replaced it with times ten all around. So we should be um, pretty much doubling our wolf input. Uh, we have... Oh yes, we did actually complete the research. Uh, I didn't mention this, it happened off camera. Uh, that was for like stone shaping or whatever, so who cares. But it does mean that we can now, apparently, build a masonry bench using stuff that we don't know how to make just yet, so that can be put off. It does mean... I've just put down something random. <laughs> Shit. Cancel that. <laughs> right. Uh, it does mean that we do need to choose some new research. Better livestock farming. Oh, log cabin! That might be useful. So, we, we'll need a little loggy poos. A Kenny logging -y poos. Bung that there. Look, we've now guided the robot to go on the roads. And it's actually faster. So, that has actually helped after all that. So, has this actually worked then? I mean, we could increase capacity of uh, cooking bots now, because I think we have got. Now, we've actually got rid of that rogue pie f uh, bits feeder, which I think was actually soaking up a lot of the pumpkin bits, which I didn't realise this previously. When we had two chef bots doing the same thing, I didn't realise that there was a, th that rogue robot um, stealing all the bits of bi um, bits, which I think that was, yeah, the reason for that. Berry-wise, because we've got so many berries, I think we can probably get a second chef doing exactly the same thing. I might be able to um, just use the same cooking pot, and therefore I could literally just clone the uh, the trouble is, it takes so long going backwards and forwards. Um, they'd get in each other's way, wouldn't they? And then stop add, start trying to add things. I don't know, that might work. I might give this a go. Let's use one of you. So let's try this as a um, chef test. We've got a chef test. Um, get rid of all the programming, because we don't need that anymore. We need to find the floppy disk, which is over there at the moment. So I really need to put this somewhere sensible. So I'm going to go teach. We're going to go over here. Wait until uh, the chef has finished his duties. Has created his bits. Um, this is taking a bit of time. Oh, it's because they're all. Mm. There we go. Right, wait for him. There. No, no, stop, 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 <laughs> mate. Right, so I'm going to copy the berry lad. And chef test. Paste it to you. Now let's see if having two chefs on one pot does the business. It might work. Because they won't add, like, um, weeds. Well, it should be okay. We'll see. As I say, I don't know if I'm 100% sure if this is going to be any good or not. It may double the output, it may, they may just get in each other's way and then clog up the, the pot, but we'll see. These things need fuel, these new cooking pots, but I think if you're just still using uh, mixing pot recipes, I don't think it actually uses the fuel up. Alright, so this is going to be the berries, isn't it? So what's going on over here? Berry store. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Right, so what have we got in here at the moment? Nothing. I shall bring the chef. Is the chef tester? Oh, the chef tester is already in there. Is actually that's actually in the wrong thing then, isn't it? So we've made herby pumpkin. That's no good. Let's put this into the chefs. 
I think I might have actually stalled the spice berry thing. Hang on. No, it's, which one is it? Uh, the one of them stopped. So I, need to, I just need to sort that out. Your oh, herbie berries is fine. You're fine. And you're fine. So you're trying to take from the berry storage one, but there's for some reason it's not working. Have you got some... Oh, maybe he's got something in his hands. Hang on. This can happen. Oh, I've got, I've got a robot in my hand. Come on. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, he's got wood in his hands. There we go. Meanwhile, what are you? Chef Herbie Berries. You, you should be... Uh, you should be on the move. Although now you've got bloody stuff in your hands. God. Steel. Oh, just... Uh, get rid of the stuff. There. Now go, Herbie Berries, go. Get your stuffs and see what happens. Now, finally. Finally. So at the moment, I think he's just finished doing his cooking, so... Let's have a look. This is where we see if they get in each other's way or not. Because he's... Okay, the second bot is trying to add berries to it. Now, hopefully it should just stop and get confused. As the other one will come along, do the cooking... Grab the stuff. That's fine. Yes, that actually works. I may have actually not really double capacity, though, because it's there's still going to be a bit of waiting around. I'm hoping this has actually increased capacity, but I'm not 100% sure it actually has again. All right. It's actually called Chef Spiced Berries, technically. Technically. Uh, one... Putting really out of character space now. And you can be spice berries too. There. So that may have helped. Okay, so I've actually doubled capacity for the um, pumpkins as well. I think it does, it does speed things up a little bit. It's not, And it's not quite doubling, but it seems to be doing the trick because whilst one lad is moving around the place, the other one is busy cooking up. I could actually move the, the weeds as well because that seems to be a bit pointless having it over here because they gather the weeds here put them in there, and then the cooks come over back to there, so there's no other use for them, so... Oh, wait, what am I doing? So I do need to move these. They're too busy, everyone's trying to grab stuff, but I'm too quick for them. Uh, where am I going to put it? Weeds. I'll put them there, I think. Now they have to go over there instead. Unfortunately, now I think I might have confused... Oh no, this is just, it's just out of juice. Hopefully the robots aren't too confused, and they will actually go about their business now. Baby maker? Oh, the baby maker. I haven't actually used him for a long time. Uh, let's just put him... Actually, with his baby making equipment over there. Right, so that should um, um, cut down their journeys massively, so... Now we probably don't need the extra robots at all here, but... Uh, we'll see. I really want to just like him. I'd, I think now we've got... Oh, the berries situation, yeah, we do need... We do need to do that. We do need to have... Hang on. I'm not going to bother doing the copy and paste thing, because it's, so, it's very, very simple. Um, you. You'll do. So, Berry Star. This is like Berry Star 5, even though there's only like one other one of them. <laughs> but, okay, grab. And star. Oh, yeah, we have to sort out a lot of them. Um, repetition as well. And also, max area. That's fine. No repetition. Getting very quick at doing this now. Uh, up. Repeat until the hand's full. Get out of there. Repeat until the hand's empty. Repeat. Go. And Berry Store 5 can go into... I think these come, I think these come under the... Storage filler, so I'll put that into there. Uh, technically not. Well, um, <laughs> I want to be consistent. They can go to storage fillers. So there's literally only two berry farmers now, two bashers. Um, but they also yeah, get two people st doing the stirring as well. So that should hopefully stop us running out of berries too quickly. Pumpkin pie seems to be... Oh, I keep saying pumpkin pie. 
uh, raw pumpkin does seem to be reasonably good because we are bashing the hell out of our pumpkins. So if things go, if things, st if we start to lose all our berries, I'll add yet another storage lad and maybe another bu a berry basher because I think there's plenty of capacity for that. And yes, I am building more walls and I'm building more um, stone tracks so we can flesh out our colony even more. And then once we actually do get enough food into them, it's actually going very fast now. Um, I'll, be, I'll be able to add more colonists and we'll upgrade to log shacks and everything will be wonderful. Cool, I feel a lot more confident. Now we've redefined a little bit, or re redesigned the colony a little bit, I feel a lot better. I think things are getting more efficient and there's plenty of room for uh, additions as well. Let's just finish off by seeing what the hell we can now make at our good workbench. A chisel and mallet out of blade pole and mallet. I think we can, we can make those, can't we? And then I can probably do something to do with the masonry bench. Um, but yeah, we'll see what we're doing next time because um, everything's going to be grand. Hopefully we'll get up to level 3 feeding and that'll be really rather wonderful. Okay, thanks for watching. Um, usual things. Check out the link to the Patreon if you want to support us. S subscribe. Leave a like. Leave a comment. Do what you want. I'm not the boss of you. See you next time.